Currently, there's no vaccination or medication to cure an infection of COVID-19. Antibiotics do not work on viruses, so there's no point in trying to get them from your medical team. The virus affects all ages, but the elderly and people with existing medical conditions are more prone to severe symptoms. Treatment is currently just to give non-specific but appropriate medication to treat the symptoms rather than the virus itself. There are rumours that eating things like garlic, sesame oil and washing your nose with saline help, but the World Health Organization, or WHO, say that there is no evidence to show they have any benefit. WHO also say there is no risk from receiving a letter or parcel from an infected area and the use of UV lamps will not kill the virus but can cause skin irritation. The main advice in preventing an infection is to adopt good hand hygiene. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water or use alcohol hand gel. Hot air hand dryers will dry your hands but not kill the virus. The use of alcohol and chlorine sprays over your body will not help if you're already infected. There's a lot of talk about taking temperatures by using non-contact thermometers and whether this is an effective way of detecting if someone is infected. It will show if the person has a fever, which is a sign of COVID-19 infection, but it can take a few days to become sick once infected, so someone may be infected but not show a temperature. Catch coughs and sneezes with disposable tissues and dispose of them correctly as soon as they're used. If you do not have a tissue, use your sleeve. Once you have sneezed or cough, wash your hands or use alcohol hand gel. Avoid touching your eyes, nose and mouth with unwashed hands and finally, avoid close contact with people who are unwell. COVID-19 does survive on surfaces and you can catch it, so good surface cleaning is important. WHOs say that the virus can last on surfaces for up to three days, maybe more depending on the types of material, the temperature and the humidity.